Welcome to Good Mythical More. If it's good enough to wash your dog's teeth, then it's good enough for us to try it here, right? It's always good enough, and it's always good enough of a time to check our voicemail. Yo, you need to pick up your butt. Yo, you need to pick up your butt. That's the kind of thing that we would have called somebody. Actually, we would have been doing prank calls and then we would have given you a turn. <laughs> <laughs> and you would have said something like that. Don't you remember those days? Yeah, man. Let's I give just, Link a turn. Just, just you free, need to pick free up wheeling. your butt. Okay, so we have all types of things that clean dog's teeth. Do you give your dog these things? Because I was actually looking at Barbara's mouth the other day and I was like, she. She's got some like, she's got some tartar, man. Well, yeah, because if you look before and after on this, you've got this nice white. Barbara's teeth. teeth but then they're black at the top. Her but, gums are fine, but her teeth are brown at the top. Well, it says right Is there. It, does it matter it she's says, like a wolf? These pictures say simulation. I think when wolves eat stuff, they really rip it apart and it really helps keep it clean. And that's what some of these chew toys um, simulate. Self-brushing. scissors. Self brushing toothbrush for dogs. It brushes their teeth while they chew. Works in three ways. Hidden bristles brush your dog's teeth while they play. Slot shaped openings scrape off tartar and plaque. Nubs on the outside massage the gums. But really? Do you put food or like flavored um, toothpaste in it? Because this is good. This right here is the type of. This is the type of um Oh, it's got a little give to it. This is the type of brush that I have at my house for Jade. And you use it? I have it when I give her a bath to also brush her teeth. And sometimes I do it, but not every time. That's not brushing my teeth, that's just cleaning the bottoms of my teeth. Let me try this. You put some peanut butter in there, that'd be nice. I don't think you're supposed to put anything in there. It doesn't say. Yeah, the, well, what's, what's that? What's that on the end? It's just, what do you mean? What's that? Um, Turns it on and off? The secret. The nubs of the outer sleeve massage gums, the slots scrape off plaque. Yo, the slots, your, their little but canine it, teeth get in there. See if I can get one tooth in there. But it doesn't, does it have a flavor because? Rubber. Why would they be motivated to chew on this? for a long time if it doesn't have a flavor. Because dogs just sit there and chew on things. Jay doesn't chew on anything. Well, you have a cat for a dog. But most dogs, Barbie just will sit there and just chew on anything. Things she's supposed to chew on, things she's not supposed to chew well, on. Well, you, you should definitely give her that and maybe it'll fix her fix her problem. I think her mouth is too small. I'll take it home to her, see what she says. Well, I wanna try it. You open the neck, here. You can just take one of those. This is already open. Good gosh. The way packaging is made, man, it's freaking dangerous for people like me. Is this if you got a big dog and a little dog and you want to get a two for one? Maybe. Or is it, you know what it is? It's so you can brush, I love this idea. You can brush your teeth and your doggy's teeth at the same time. <laughs> I like when Barbara's face is next to mine. Jade does not like it. Um, but the that's just a human toothbrush. We put toothpaste on the on that, and she likes to lick it. She likes the taste of it. Oh man, that's a lot more bendy than I thought. Doggy toothpaste, not regular toothpaste. Doggy toothpaste, which we can try because we have some here. We're gonna try some doggy tartar control here in a second. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I like I like this for myself. Yeah, How come they don't make toothbrushes like this? So you you're gonna take this on the barber? Yeah. I mean, if you get, I'm trying to see if I can get an incisor in there. Did Were you able to do that? I got one worked in there a little bit. You don't have incisors. You don't. Like I got well, the, I got I the. I have incisors. There's a tooth in my incisor position that is called an incisor, but it is not, it doesn't have a vampire point on it. Like mine does. Cause I'm not evil. Mine, mine will puncture the crap out of my lip and my tongue and steaks and stuff. Bully bone super brush. There is a little satisfaction in really biting down on this stuff. Now see, I think this is a scam. I've seen these in the pet store. A lot of times they're green, the dental chews. 
You can't. What is the answer to the um to the small brush, big brush, such like ones for like back teeth? Oh, ones for a cat, ones for a dog. I, I think it. I think it's for options. And then when you try to get to the back, it's hard. You know, it's hard to get in there, right? Do you brush uh, Ringo Ringo's teeth? No, but boy, he he needs it already. He's not even. He's like a, a little bit over a year old. I can't imagine brushing a cat's teeth. I mean, I can barely touch my cat. This isn't doing anything. This is just, this a, is just a plastic. It's a piece of plastic. I mean, I could three D print this. It smells like shaving cream. Nope, that's just my face. I mean, I'm not brushing anything. I'm just hurting myself. Oh gosh. Yeah, there's no. This is just a piece of plastic. What What are they trying to sell this as? Oh, it's got apple cinnamon flavor. Shoe scrub technology. <laughs> Asimon cinnamon. I don't know why I say Asimon cinnamon. Seminal. Teeth scrubbing bristles infused with baking soda form as your dog chews. There's no flavor in this. What? Maybe you have to get inside of it somehow. Clean and scrape hard to reach areas of dog's teeth and mouth, the ridges and bumps. Scam. I just, I'm not buying this. Well, technically you already did. But it says scrubbing bristles infused with baking soda form as your dog chews. But you've taken oh, them Oh, to... so it exposes some bristles. The way it breaks down is in bristly form, yes? Steve? You've taken them to get their teeth brushed, or have you not? Well, I mean. Like a teeth cleaning. We take her to the groomer, to the vet. But. Are they doing that? No. Yeah, Barbara needs needs help. She. <laughs> I don't know how Enzo they would do used that. to have like the worst breath ever, and then when he went and got a, a, a teeth cleaning, it would actually like change everything for like you know a few weeks, and then it would get really bad again. But most old dogs have to have teeth pulled because they're causing like I mean they're de they're decaying and causing the worst breath ever. So oh. Enzo's teeth were great in the end. Oh, Shout gosh. out to you, and May he rest in peace. What a good boy. This is horrible. <laughs> this tastes like something a dog would like. Yeah, you're brushing your teeth with dog toothpaste. I mean, ah, uh, it's like rotten bottom of a trash can. I wonder how they would clean. Oh God! How do they clean a dog's teeth at a groomer? Sometimes do they have to put them to sleep, which is not great. It's like cheese I mean, flavored toothpaste. Not that type to sleep, like. You know, yeah. Twilight. Twilight. You know, yeah. You know. What I'm it says they show, they put they put Twilight on and they fall asleep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's. I mean, I've fallen asleep during all the Twilights. This uh, one. This one tastes like. It tastes like um, sun, sunscreen. It, horrible. It's coconutty. Yeah. Do we have different flavors? It's vanilla ginger. And I, and I, why do you got to put what flavor it is? You think you're going to tell your dog? Oh, it's vanilla and ginger. I kind of I kind of don't dislike it. It's sweet. It doesn't taste like vanilla or ginger. It tastes like some rotten cheese. It tastes like coconut. Am I am I alone in this? You don't taste coconut? Uh, no, I don't taste coconut. I, I don't think it's um, the worst thing in the world, but I think a dog would love it. I'm taking it home to Barbara. The For first time brushers, put a small amount of toothpaste on your finger and invite the dog to lick it off. Slowly progress to lifting your dog's lips and rubbing the toothpaste on your finger along the gum line and teeth. When your pet is comfortable, put a small amount of toothpaste, oh, then introduce the brush. When does it say put Twilight on? Put a small amount of toothpaste on a toothbrush or finger brush and repeat the above steps. Always make brushing a positive experience for your dog. You can do it. For best results, This is gonna brush be great for you. Daily. I, I I He's actually got that kind of time. I actually believe with with little old Jade's mouth I could I could use this and this would work. I'm going to I'm going to take some of these home. I'm going to try this out. Um Jade doesn't have bad breath. She eats she eats dry dog food and it's supposed to help keep everything. That's all Barbara eats and she still got the spots, man. It's it's probably um you know by breed as well. See, this feels, ooh, that feels good. And I can tell, I can feel each tooth. 
And you know, she doesn't bite me. If I put my hand in her mouth, she doesn't bite me. She's like an alligator. In a like a like a Florida alligator zoo and you're the trainer and people gather around. Watch me put my hand in my dog's mouth. Yeah. See that? Now this taste this rubber tastes weird. Yeah. Well when you tell her that, just keep it positive. This this was gonna taste weird. Don't bite me. It feels good though. I, I might take up the habit. <laughs> Get the Feel Good Mythical Morning Tea sticker and enamel pen now at mythical.com.